Hello everyone, my name is Chicken Paul, and this is uh, Resident Evil. <laughs> so uh, last episode, we went and we uh, burnt a bunch of zombies. We had to deal with those because uh, they come back as like these like weird feral things, and they're like they're kind of assholes, you know. Um, then we we've been opening a bunch of opening up a bunch of rooms. I think this is one of the rooms that we went into. Yeah, we went in here. Um, I did do some stuff, just a very little. I uh, basically just kind of dumped off some of the stuff that we picked up, and then. Um, combine these things over here. Actually, there was a, there was a green one and a red one over here. So I picked up the green one and the red one, and then I tried to combine them. But in my uh, in my brilliance, I uh, used the green one. So uh, that happened. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I had to go back and grab another green one. I just wanted to like make sure I had some health on me. Um, yeah, I don't think there's anything else in these areas for us. So this is just like some bedroom. Oh, dude, it's so fucking trippy. There we go. One thing I hate about this game. There's two things that I hate about this game. It's the doors and the walking. The doors and the walking. I used my lockpick. We're going in here, everybody. It's gonna be crazy. There's gonna be a, a hack slashing hack slasher in here. It's a fucking meth lab. Okay, we got a field report here. Uh, researchers will. A letter is slipped inside. The top part of the letter is torn off. The rest of the letter is legible. Alma, uh, I have tried to survive only to see you again, but my efforts only delayed. The inevitable, I am infected and there is no cure for what will follow except the end of my life before I lose the only thing that separates me from them. My love for you. In an hour, I'll have entered my eternal sleep. There is uh, where there is peace. Uh, please understand. Please know that I'm sorry. Martin Crackhorn. More like crack addict. Okay. Oh, what's that? Disappear. Am I the only one who sees that? I got a fishing hook. Uh, okay. Nice. What am I doing? Fishing in this thing? The water tank smells like something once lived in there. Perhaps someone was using it. There is some kind of creature. Oh, that's fucking great. Hey, what are these? Ooh. I got a bee. There's a switch underneath, press it. Nothing happens. Maybe it has something to do with the insect specimen. All right. What's over here? Oh, another bee. I got a... I got two bees. Two bee continued. Haha, -ha, got it. Okay. I don't know what the fuck I do with these bees. The hell am I supposed to do with it? Uh, I'm pretty sure we've done everything in this area, so we can leave now. And we're going to go drop this stuff off. Because we did pick up quite a few things. We'll go drop these bees off. Go around to the rest of the house and kind of like just uncover the rest of it. So we have a gold bee. And then we have the bee specimen. Probably put those close to each other. I feel like. Oh, we also got a lure. Okay. Now I can lure the children into my van. That's a joke, you two. Don't take that serious. I don't need to be demonetized before I get monetized, okay? I think we're done with that area. But there is... Yes, there's a door there. So let's go through that door. Or at least attempt to go through that door. I'm always worried because I've killed a lot of zombies and I don't remember where all of them are. Is this the, uh, yes. 
It's locked. Uh, helmet. Okay, we need the helmet key. I wish there was a way to, like, draw on the map. Like, yeah, this right here. Helmet key. So now... I guess we got some spots over here on this side of the map that we can do. We just gotta get over that side. Get through here. Which leads us here. We basically just run around. That door back there is just going to lead us into that one office area. I remember that one. This leads us into the gas chamber where they tried to gas us. There's some stairs here with a locked door. We can try that one. Seems like we're coming across more stuff now that we have this new key. You gonna come back? Hello? I don't think he is. Okay. Go through here. I don't know. I feel like because he wasn't he bit by like a giant poisonous snake or something. We need that uh, gas again. We need to take care of him. Last thing I need is this asshole coming back and biting me in the butt. That's gonna be big bad, big bad. Fuck, no, go through. What's in there? Don't even care. Don't even care. It has nothing to do with me. That man is guarding something and it's his right. Shield key. His right as an American. Okay, apparently we're going in there. You guys ready? Because the Lord knows I'm not. <clears throat> Look at him in my face. Is there another one? Okay, never mind. There isn't. <clears throat> okay, what did we not grab in this place? Let's uh, put this away before I accidentally shoot it again. We got two, two more left. Two more shots. Too dark to see anything. Oh! Oh, we can light up the candles. Oh, we need to go get the lighter. We also need to get the lighter so we can burn that body. We're gonna do that. I didn't think about using the lighter. Okay, we're gonna burn that body and then we're gonna we're gonna get the canteen as well. Okay. okay, we got this. We got this. Quite happy at the fact in the newer Resident Evil games you don't have to burn the bodies. Oh, that's a godsend. It's so much better. So much better. Okay, yeah. So we just headed this way. here into a fucking wall because I'm looking up <laughs> okay now we're gonna get the lighter we're gonna get the canteen then we're going to burn that body we're going to light the candle we're going to go down these stairs one step at a time I hate the if I've said it once I've said it a million times I hate the walking in this game That is the one thing that in the uh, Resident Evil remakes that they did, they did get that right. Alright. I think we're good. I don't think we need any of that other stuff. Uh, also, that one wooden door that says we need, like, the shield key or whatever. Like, dude, that thing's so rick rickety. Like, I could, I could just, like, blow on it and it should fall down. I, I don't see why we need a special key for that door. I feel like the games just try to be difficult. Trying to make it very hard for us to do anything. 
Look at my paleness in that camera. Holy crap. All right. Now we're going to go through here. Watch. I go through this damn door and he's going to be, he's going to turn. In the time that it took me for me to go to there, back, he turned. Not him, the other dude. I don't know if he turns. Can I burn his body too? Apparently, if I would have saved him, I would have gotten a, a good shotgun. Well, you live and you learn. You live and you learn. Burn, baby, burn. Just go and burn. Oh, burn, baby, burn. Oh, can't monetize this video. We go through here. Uh, I think we go like this. Use. All right, now what? Ooh, shotgun shells. All right, can I fucking walk back here? You can't carry any more items, so I got some musical stuff. Uh, also, I think there's a jar here. And can I do anything with that jar? No. This jar looked like it was like usable in some way. But other than that musical note, there's like nothing else here. Which I don't know what I'm gonna do with the music notes anyways, cause my chick's a cop. Uh, I mean, she might not be, and I don't know. Who knows? Maybe it's not even piano. I'm just guessing it's piano. So I guess now we'll probably head back and reload the shotgun. Um, it's this way? No, the other way. No, it's the other way. Getting a little better with the walking. Just... The fixed cameras kill me. That was the greatest thing they ever, they ever got rid of, was the fixed cameras. I mean, don't get me wrong, it like it adds to the vibe of Resident Evil. Like, then I spend 15 minutes just trying to get down these fucking stairs. <laughs> and that's pretty much the entire episode. This is more of a this isn't like a zombie game. This is more of a try to get down the stairs game. I feel like controller might be easier. Okay, we don't need the canteen right now. Uh, let's uh, grab the shotgun, wherever that is, here. Okay, let's get out of here. And... Can I just... I think I can just combine it, can I? There we go. I have to go through all that trouble. Alright. We're just going to put the shotgun away for now. I think we can put the lighter away as well. And now we're going to head out again on the grand adventure of dis discovering everything this place has to offer. I feel like we're getting a little further. We're getting more stuff. We still need to get those musical notes, which we should probably do right now before I forget. I'm bound to forget that. So let's get those real quick. And then I think... We've gone through a lot of doors this ep uh, these past two episodes, so. so. I'm hoping we're, like, uncovering most of the stuff. We need two more keys, I think. Uh, we still need the shield key, and we still need the sword key. So I'm not sure where we're going to get those. But once we do have those, things should, uh, things should look up. You know? Grab these musical notes. <sighs> I have lockpicks. Why the fuck do I need special keys? Yep. 
Musical score. Is there anything else there, actually? Shelves are lined with glass. All right. Nothing else. Oh, those flames are moving. I thought they were moving. Uh, I guess we can... Do we have to drop this off? I guess it makes sense to just drop it off. We have to head back that way anyways, I think. Or somewhere in that direction. So I think it just makes sense to drop it off. I feel like I feel like most of my time has been spent running to drop things off. I have like five hours in the game already, something like that. And most of my time has been spent dropping stuff off. But you know, they don't give me the ability to drop things. I wish I could just like drop certain things and just come back and pick them up later. That'd be helpful, but they don't give you that ability. So even though this is kind of out of our way and we want to progress on and do other stuff, we might as well just stack up this stuff. And then having all these things here, instead of trying to like remember where they are, now we know that these things are here. So like, oh, now we need the musical notes. Let's go there. Oh, we need the bees. We can go over there. We need that shield thing. We can go there. We need that wooden plank thing. We can go here. We, got, we know it's all here. So it's going to save us time in the in the long run. Right now, it's a pain in the ass, but in the long run, it's going to save us a lot of time. Now, if we knew how to speed run this, we could basically just save even more time and, uh, and just know how to do everything in order. But we don't know how to speed run, so. Or at least I don't. Maybe you do. So I think the goal now is to get on like this side. So we're gonna head all the way around, go through that door, head across to yep. So I think we're, our goal now is to go to this side of the side of the map. Let's do that. Not sure how many armored doors there are, but yeah, I was ready to say armored doors. Yeah, because we have the armor key. I'm just gonna call them armored doors. Makes them sound like mysterious or something, but. There is a door in this area, like this little lobby area up in the top that uh, that we can go through, but I think that's a sword key, if I'm not mistaken. I kind of want to kill him. I'm going to kill this dude just because he's going to become a nuisance later. That dude, I should have just left alone. I should have just left him do his, like, thing. Instead of, like, attacking him. Because, like, killing him was kind of a waste. But not only a waste of ammo, but, like... A waste of everything. Sorry, Squishy. That was Squishy, guys. I had to kill him, though. Well, I had to kill him again. I didn't really have to kill him the first time. But we just had... All the okay, there's this door here. Go through here now. Locked from the other side, so we can't go through there. Oh god, that dude's gonna turn two. We're gonna need more kerosene. Yeah, so we head through here. Where's locked from the other side? What? Where does this take us? This takes us up the stairs. This takes us to some stairs where we haven't looted everything. I think the only thing that's there, though, is a bunch of heels. If I'm not mistaken. Let's go up here. I think this takes us to the third floor. Let's go there and we'll check this place out. Yeah, this takes us up to the third floor where it tried to crush us. Locked, yeah, helmet key. Can you still take this? There's no need to take this anymore. <laughs> I don't know. Man can try, man can try. Uh, I 
I don't know what we have to do. This game's confusing, very confusing. So I guess we've searched all that. We can go through here. Can't go through that door for some reason. I don't know why. Actually, I guess we could. We could just go. Yeah, let's let's see if we can unlock that door. Fucking hell. Fucking hell. Hello? Whew. Calm down there. Calm down there, Aqua, te Aqua Team Hunger Force guy. So where do we go? Yeah, through this door. I think. Yeah, through this door and then we'll just circle around through the other one. Because then we should be able to lock, unlock that other door since it's locked from the other side. We'll be able to unlock it. Hopefully. At least that's the plan. I think there's also going to be dudes in here, sadly. Unless if I burnt those buddies. I think I burnt all those buddies. I can't remember off the top of my head. You're gonna get fucked when I get this shotgun. You're fucked once I get this shotgun, bro. You're fucked when I get the shotgun. He's done for. Done for. Yeah, killing all these zombies was a big, big, big bad idea. I killed way too many. Now it's haunting me. Uh, can I just acid the dude to death? I know we have acid, don't we? We have acid ones. Um, we'll grab the... We're actually going to save here, just in case, because I don't know how this is going to go. But we can grab the, uh, the shotgun as, like, a last resort. Because you know what they say, the grenade launcher with acid darts doesn't kill him, or grenades or whatever. Then the... Can I save? Thank you. Yes. Alright, now we're going to save on this very end one. And then we'll just like circle through again. Medical storage. Nice. Let's kill this man. I don't know if he's going to be right there. Does that kill him? Let's find out. We'll go through here and then we'll come back and if he's there, still there, then no, it didn't kill him. If he isn't there, then yes, it killed him. I feel like it's acid, it should kill him. Okay, he's not there anymore. So yes, it did. It did kill him. Ah, good. Oh my God! Hey, bro! Holy fuck! Whew. I forgot about him. I forgot about him. Oh God! Put your to handgun. Oh, helmet key. Fuck you, helmet key. Okay, I unlocked it. Oh, God. Whew. That was not fun. That was not fun. I, th I was like, I thought there was a second one here somewhere, but uh, maybe I was wrong. Maybe I burnt that one. Okay, now I know we pissed the crows off in the one area, but did we piss the crows off everywhere? Okay, I don't think we pissed off the crows here. Pick these up. Okay, let's not pick those up, apparently. 
Um. Oh, hey, look, there's my reflection. I guess there's still a lot more places we can go and, like, do. So that we can't do, that one we can't do. That one we can't do, that one we can't do. This one we can't do. We're on this floor now. So that's the bottom floor, that's that thing. So can we do this door? I'm not sure, we'll have to check that out. We still have these doors here, so we might want to try those doors. And we got a few more. I don't think we can get that one. We can't get that one. We can't get that one. We can't get these two. This one I think is armored key or something like that. Or uh, other key. But we can try that one out. I think we've tried out most of the doors. Um, but with that being said, I guess we'll end the episode here. And then we'll like search the rest of these places afterwards. So I'd like to thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.